Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Cancer with a clear, concise message from you. So Cancer, we have the Wheel of Fortune. All right, so the psychic abilities, either for yourself or other people. It's like you can tap into or you're, you're tapping into, cluing into, uh, maybe even your person. This could be someone close to you. So um, or you have a close connection with someone. You guys kind of maybe even uh, communicate telepathically or you can just tune in. This is because you got your soul is connected to this person. Soul made to inflame, like partner. I don't know. This is also feeling like you've met the one or if you're asking about a particular person yes they are a soulmate yes you are seeing something clearly it's like the universe aligned something for for you to take some action or you're or you're you're trying to right place right time space time it's like you're trying to get in the same place or same time period as somebody I don't know it's like or this is what someone's doing it in regards to you it's like heavy mental heavy mental uh, activity it, intensely thinking about somebody over and over um, it's like you're trying to penetrate somebody's auric field energetic field if I think about you you'll think about me even if we're worlds apart if we're you know, we're, we're miles apart, if you will. Um, the will of fortune. Something changed. Or somebody, you're trying to get somebody to change their mind or, or someone's trying to get you to change your mind. Your, your mind has been made up or changed. Maybe surrounding Sagittarius or maybe around Sagittarius season. Your mind will be changed. You hope that someone changes their mind. Or maybe even around Pisces season. It's just about... It's, I don't know if you're trying to use like a God type... Concept, complex, context. I don't know if you're trying to just use something to get what you want or to make something real or to manifest. It's like you take an action. But the action is all in, of the mind. It's like you're using your, like, all your brain power to get someone to change. Yeah, you're definitely putting something out there. Like, or this is what someone else is doing. Like, um, it could be magic. It could be spell. It could be whatever. I don't know. It could just be you subliminal messages. Maybe via social media. Mental, telepathic, telepathic messages. This is what someone is doing. This is what you're doing. You're hoping for a reunion with someone or that you come back together, that you can have fun, positive vibes, uh, a good time with a particular person. Hoping that they come back home, that things become more positive. It's like you're trying very hard or someone's trying very hard to get your attention and just they want you to maintain your attention on them or this is what you want I want to get your attention then I want to have it focused on me it's like you're trying to force or someone's trying to force their way into your life your your energy this is somebody on the outside of your life on the outside of something this was a, like a rocky type of connection relationship friendship whatever like it just went up and down it was it wasn't a smooth ride You or the other person feels it's like it was too much. And it, it's been too much hurt. Too much of unknown. It was Every day was a challenge or a struggle to maintain this friendship, connection, business, whatever. Therefore, somebody has taken a back seat. Not focused on. Removed themselves. Estrangement. It could have been because somebody was too active. Maybe sexually or there was... Lots of uh, parties or like physical party or lots of um, 
participants, lots of love partners or lovers, or someone could even go as far as to say that somebody had a sexual addiction that they were hiding or trying to mask behind. Somebody lives in fantasy, like, if I can just get this person to change their mind, we'll run off into the sunset. There's also somebody here who wants a feminine energy back. Masculine wants feminine energy back. Doesn't have to be male and female, but masculine energy wants feminine energy back. But they're never going to leave a marriage or ne they're never going to divorce a lifestyle. They're never going to conform. They're never going to have a traditional relationship. It's going to be unconventional, you know, non-traditional. I don't know. There's also, Cancer, some of you going to put something out to the world and it's going to take off like wildfire and successful completion to a project. People wanting to patronize you, big contract, landing something here, it coming into your lap. Um, it just looks like whatever you're doing, this is going to be extremely um, profitable, wildly successful. Um, also, like um, you've been at it for a while. You're not giving up. Don't give up. Hang in there you know hang in there because there is a miracle on on its way just because you have continued to persevere you've been thrown all kinds of blockage curveballs but you're persevering you're seeing it through you're you're always at almost at the end of this tough time and then you, you can it, it will turn into something else uh, it will disseminate into different type of energy. Yeah, you can go into a period of rest, sharing, a period of peace, calm, maybe financial stability by doing something that you absolutely love. Yeah. So um, that's what I have for you, Cancer. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. What are you about to put out to the world that's about to be wildly successful? Who is trying to bring you back knowing that they don't really have much to offer it. Let me know how it all resonates for you. Get your own personal reading. Go over to the website, book your reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. Keep in mind, every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, I am live doing a collective reading and answering your questions. Uh, 9.30 Eastern Standard Time every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night. Um... And if you took something from the reading, you can always get back. You could buy me a coffee if you like. The link is below. And if you're a business-minded individual, go ahead and connect with me via the complimentary discovery call. Or you can connect with um, like-minded business people like yourself um, by joining the monthly KTMG Keep the Momentum Going monthly conference call where you'll get valuable spiritual and practical advice of how to start, maintain, and grow your business. So... Uh, let me be of assistance if you are feeling moved to do that. So all links are below. Take care. Many blessings to you. We were meant to create. Sometimes our desires to create are blocked spiritually, mentally, emotionally, or even physically. And this prevents us from reaching our highest aspirations. If you are an entrepreneur or you would like to become one and you're in need of some sage advice and direction, then you're in the right place. As a successful entrepreneur, spiritual guide, and intuitive business coach, I can offer you the clarity and support you need to find success and reach your goals. With decades of experience as a trusted tarot card reader, a franchise owner, my practical and spiritual approach to entrepreneurship will help you reach your full potential as an established business owner. Whether you're struggling with making tough decisions or simply trying to find your path in life, I can help you learn the tools you need to create your business dream. Take some time today and schedule your free consultation with me so that we can begin to make your business dreams a reality.